everyone knows that no one is from Los Angeles. People move to Los Angeles for one thing and one thing only. Big, huge titties. <laughs> Caroline, oh, excuse me. I mean, to follow a dream. Whether it's to become the next Kelly Clarkson, Harold and Kumar, or to work for minimum wage, everyone comes to Los Angeles trying to find something. And it's usually not their pride. We're going to follow these Angelinos around on their daily adventures. I'm a businessman, and I'm on the road a lot. I'll be honest, it can get hard sometimes. Being away from the kids, the house, the home cooking, <laughs> even Roscoe, the family dog. But it's the hardest being away from my wife. I miss her laugh, her touch, her smile. But most of all, the smell of her pussy. That's why I choose Rent-A-Puss, the only car that actually smells like a pussy. Now we go to one of the billions upon billions of parking garages in Los Angeles. This one's at the popular gym, LA Fitness, where we have spent many, many hours trying to work off the bonbons and booze. Actors come to Los Angeles with dreams of winning Oscars. But a few years go by of endless ridicule, and now we simply want to book a job that pays for our Starbucks and acting classes. Ooh, don't forget our Botox and spray tans. Thanks for reminding me. Hey, um, sorry to interrupt, but that's my Civic parked in front of the Beamer. So? So, I need to leave. Didn't you just get here? Well, yeah, like 30 minutes ago. Okay, so with the time it took you to get upstairs, check yourself out in the mirror, maybe find your machine, worked out for what, like 20 minutes tops? Excuse me? I... I'm just saying, it's a pretty short workout. It's my light day. Oh, okay, what's your hard day, 28 minutes? I, I have an appointment, mm. and besides, my hard day is... Wait a minute, why am I telling you this? Can you please just get me my car? You an actress? Yeah. Been on TV? I'm working on my reel. Yeah, maybe you should just work on your thighs. You know? Uh, excuse me? I'm just saying, how many chunky actresses you see on TV? Maybe you want to drive a little Geo Metro if you weren't so chunky. It's a Civic, and I'm not chunky. Well, you ain't no size zero. Think about it. Simultaneously, another musical rehearsal is taking place in Malibu. <laughs> Malibu. <laughs> Boobies. You're a Malibu. Why, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, Miss Brittany Reason. I believe if I refuse to have sex, I can keep my vagina clean. Now I've known some girls who didn't listen And now they pee blood and scream You may ask, who told me? Well, his name is Jesus He said, girl, you better keep your cooter clean So I'm going to heaven. For others in Los Angeles, they have long forgotten their dreams. It's 5 o'clock and all the regular people are leaving their mundane office jobs and getting into their piece of shit car from the parking garage. We told you, there are billions upon billions of parking garages in Los Angeles. <laughs> Oh no, I know, right? No, no, then he says to me, no, maybe we should just take our time and not rush into sex. I mean, what the fu- <gasps> 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 Fucking fuckhead! Huh? What were you gonna do? You're gonna steal my purse? Well, you little know, fucking girly man? Huh? What a Louis Vuitton not trying to get a fucking shit face? Please stop. Yeah, but this is really embarrassing in front of all your little parking garage dwelling, purse-stealing, woman-raping friends, isn't it? Please stop kicking me. Fine. Okay? But only because these are great shoes and I don't want to ruin them on you. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna pick up my phone now. And if you even think of moving, I'm gonna stick my heel right up your ass and rip out your prostate. Guaranteed. I'm not going anywhere. Oh yeah, damn straight you're not. Right, I'm gonna dial 911 and have your piece of shit ass arrested. So take off your cheesy ski mask so I can describe you. Yes, ma'am.
Hello. Hot. Well, wasn't that fun? Our first glimpse at all the huge titties. <laughs> I mean, all the lovely people in Los Angeles. You'll have to excuse her. I mean us. We haven't gotten much sleep since we got that free preview weekend on Cinemax. Until next time, adios! adios.